So we have two more Nintendo 64 games dropping into Nintendo Switch Online plus Expansion Pack Service. What two games are they and when can we expect them? Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. So we have this post here from Nintendo of America. Extreme G and Iggy's Wrecking Balls are now live for Nintendo Switch Online plus Expansion Pack members. Will you take your cyber cycle to gravitational extremes in Extreme G or race through the towering tracks in Iggy's Wrecking Balls first? And as the post said, both of these games are available right now for Nintendo Switch Online Plus Expansion Pack members. Now let's take a look first at Extreme G. Now this is a racing game that's sort of in a futuristic setting. Or at least what we thought the future would look like back in 1997 when the game was released. Now in the game you race plasma powered bikes and you get all kinds of different power ups as you go through including some homing missiles and some mines and you can boost your shield. And many of the tracks have a lot of similarities to like roller coasters where you can do some loops and corkscrews. And one thing that the game is highly praised for is the sense of speed that you get when you're racing. Now in the game's single player mode, you have three different difficulty settings to choose from. And then you have four different game modes, which features a different number of tracks, either 3, 4, 8, or 12. Now in multiplayer, it does have four player split screen, so you should be able to play that online in NSO against your online friends. And in addition to just racing your friends, you can also play capture the flag or a battle mode. So definitely a decent game here to add into NSO. It has a Metacritic of an 82 out of 100 and mostly positive praises for the game. Next we have Iggy's Wrecking Balls. Now this is a platform racer that came out in 1998. Now you basically race up these towers and once you get to the top, you'll basically lap back to the bottom and you have to complete two or three laps to complete the tower. And overall, there's 10 different worlds with 10 different towers, so 100 towers here. And you can play this with up to four players, so you'll be able to take on your friends here on Nintendo Switch Online service. And Iggy's Wrecking Balls has a 69 over at Game Ratings, which is an aggregator, sort of like Metacritic. So a bit more of a mix here from the critics on this game. But let me know what you think. Have you played either one of these games before? And if you have, do you have any tips for people who may be playing it for the first time? Drop a comment below and let me know your thoughts. And if you like the video, be sure to give it a thumbs up. And if you haven't subscribed yet, consider doing so. It really does help the channel out quite a bit. I want to thank you for watching and be good.